So in this video, we use the old meta and see if it can hold its crown as the best strategy. So yeah, it's a really close game and watch until the end to see who wins. Okay, so we are facing the opponent Kane here. And we're basically using DFN, Darling Farm Ninja here. And if you guys didn't know, this is actually the old meta last season. This was a very dominant strategy. Um, and like it excelled, it was kind of broken, you know, but now it's actually pretty balanced. It does pretty well, actually. There's some flaws like the um, Sabo. You need to have more skilled Sabo micro. Starting off, you need to spend more on your Dartlings because they got nerfed, obviously. And I think we're going to go for the bottom path first. Um, that's a weird open spot. That's one weird open spot um, on their side there. Looks like they're going for the same strategy as us. I don't know if they're going ninja specifically, but they're probably going for like darling farm combination. Oh wait, they went for a second darling instead of powerful darts. That's a little bit weird, but it looks like they're going for the powerful darts on theirs too. So they, wait, they might actually be going for an eco strategy because you only need the powerful darts. I don't know why they went for the two darling. Or maybe they just don't know how to play Darling. I saw... I see Kane play a lot of different strategies. I don't see them playing Darling as often, so... Maybe they just don't know how to play Darling too optimally. I don't know. And I think you should... Yeah, you're just going for an Eco strategy. Okay, they're not going for Darling Farm then. It's interesting here. That's very interesting. Are they not going to be forcing the middle path Darling Gunner yet? Because you need to Eco with white to force that and they're not doing that so i can just greed for another farm i'll probably get it up right now i, I don't want to be too greedy and extra farms are really greedy enough so um i'm just gonna get this up to be even more greedier and yeah it looks like they're sending us uh, some space blacks here so we need to go for middle path and that was successful greeting there that's what you call successful they're over defending a lot actually they have the middle path darling gunner and they have the bottom path this um middle path darling is probably gonna be their hrp i'm just gonna get up maybe what do i need to get up here i'm just gonna get an extra darling two extra darlings because i don't want to upgrade the middle path yet i don't know i just don't feel like doing that yet this might have not been the right play but i feel like two darling spam is better than just middle path darling we're gonna get the middle path anyways i don't know actually why i did that um i'm just dumb i think okay let's go for the banana plantation well we need this extra darling actually if they send us uh regen zebras we need this extra darling so that might have actually been the play now we're gonna go for middle path on this darling and we're just prepared for zebras now if they send us some zebras yeah we're gonna be completely fine we don't need to get another darling because we already have another darling that's a smart play. Okay, I think we need to send some of these just to force something. Another Darling, maybe, or an upgrade. Uh, okay, we forced another Darling. That's always nice. Then some leads here. Oh, wait, they have Obin. Okay, no. We're just going to sell for HRP here. And it's kind of weird. Sometimes you don't get the hot key, key glitch, and sometimes the hot key works. Oh, my God. I accidentally placed that tower down. It's a little bit sketch. So we're gonna send a tiny rush here just because they didn't get their HRP yet. And this will force a boost. Oh, they're going for a druid. Um, I think they're dead here actually. Unless, oh, that actually handled it better than I thought. Thought they were gonna struggle a little bit more. They're going for an interesting strategy here. Ice, druid, dartling. Okay, I've never seen that strategy used before. I think we just need to um, stall until BADs and we win because you you can't really afford MAD with an eco strategy. That At least that's going to be hard for them. Um, MAD with an eco strategy is very hard, but if they can get it up, possibly they can win. I do not think they can get up a Superstorm and the MAD because those are just two very expensive towers. If they get embrittlement and an MAD, that could do a lot of damage to BADs. I feel like we have the upper hand because we have like infinite money so we can just keep sending BADs and microing our mad. So I feel like if we just take this late, we win. Their strategy is probably a little bit better mid game actually since they got the ice. Ice is really good mid game. Okay, let's go for 
our central market on round 15 here and let's go for another banana farm before the round starts extra couple dollars here um i think we'll be able to get up uh this marketplace bottom path here let's go for the bottom path and i'm probably just gonna send one more lab towards them here because they don't have uh, too much defense they'll probably need more druid spam or something like that um, but now that I think of it, they might actually be able to just defend them all up with their defense. Since they got the brambles in the back. I don't know if it's going to be worth sending. So, we're going to be watching out for if their eco stops. If they want to send a Moab here. And it doesn't look like they're going to send a Moab. They're constantly ecoing. Yeah, they're not sending a Moab anytime soon. I'm not going to rush them as well. I'm just going to chill here. With my Dartling. Dartling, you can basically chill. Um, like, round 0 to like 13. You need to get your HRP. Then you're chilling for a couple more rounds. They're definitely not getting as much money as we are. Going to get when we get our Monkey Wall Street on round 20. Because this is... We're on track to get a round 20 Monkey Wall Street right now. Possibly round 19, maybe even. But, yeah. They're not going aggressive on us. They're just being very passive. Which I feel like is the right play for an eco strategy, like theirs, because if you play aggressive, you'll lose eco and you'll lose money for farming and stuff. They're getting up the druid farms while ecoing with pinks. And can we even get it this round? We need twenty thousand dollars. Okay, I'm just gonna buy trees here, and I'm gonna put my trees right here. So maybe we'll be able to sell our HRP for. Monkey Wall Street. We just need $15,000. Then we can sell both of them. Oh, we can get it up. This is going to be close. Oh, we got it. We got it. We got it. Nice. Please don't send a rush. Don't. Okay, now they're sending a Moab rush. I think I'm just going to... Oh, that's perfect. 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 This is perfect scenario. We have the perfect amount of money to go for a sabotage here. And we're going to go like this. And we are going to use that. Do that. I'm gonna boost just in case. Um, because we already have we didn't use any of our boosts, so I'm fine with using a boost here. And uh I just went for a second one just in case, and it looks like we're chilling. Oh my god, we got away with that. Central baby markety, okay. And I'm literally playing so passively, I haven't rushed them one time yet. Um, only for like round 11 early game to force HRP, but nothing really than forcing defense. I haven't rushed them aggressively, so that's good. I'm starting to get out of my aggressive shell. I used to play really aggressively with DFN, and that was not good for me because DFN is a passive strategy usually, and it's best when it's passive, so. Okay, let's aim these darlings down. Good thing I have two of these uh, rocket storms here so I can easily defend that. And I might just use a rocket storm here. Why not? Just to clean up the insides here. Um, we have two rocket pods. Rocket storms. Uh, why not? Go for banana central. Go for sticky bomb here. And we're going to start preparing for DDTs. And I feel like I'm playing this game really smoothly. I sh have to not die to anything stupid. Get a flash bomb over defend a little bit. Get that down get this up okay get this up get this up get this up okay get that up i'm just gonna over defend a little bit more since i don't want to die or anything and i think that's enough um defense to be good okay now we're just gonna out farm them i don't know how much uh druids are like, how much worse druids are compared to farms. I know farms are the best farming tower, obviously. Best all eco. I don't know if druids are, um, like, how good they're, they are compared to farms. I know they're still really good because I'm pretty experienced with the druid. I used to use druid a lot in, like, season four. or No, season three. I used DF... I, um, meta abused in season four. DFN all the way. Hashtag DFN. Um, okay... Boom, boom. And, um... Let's get up our fifth tier farm here. We can get up our fifth tier farm. Do-do. It only costs $50,000. 
I'm saying only, I don't know why. It costs a big amount of $50,000 here. Well, we can afford it. We have so much money here. So much money on hand. Oh my, this is beautiful. Beautiful here. Oh, they're sending ZMGs. Um, I guess I'll just go for... Are they gonna put DDTs underneath? I can just sell this. I have a lot of money anyways. I'm gonna put my trees in the back to eat them up. They're trying to stop my farms here, which is a good play for them. I can just sell for... I can just use this ability. And I'll probably have enough for Master Bomber anyways. Yeah, I'm just like $2,000 off. I don't need to sell any of my farms here. I can just go for Master Bomber. And GG's. Nicely done. I don't have a good amount of farms right now. Um, I need to get one more farm down and I'll be happy. You, I, I'm just gonna put eight farms down. I don't really think I need more. I don't really think that's necessary here. And, um, so we're gonna get this up. I'm gonna get this up. We're gonna get max buff here. Maxi buff. Max buff. Um, we're gonna use this ability. And, um... I'm just gonna go for one of these top half guys. Just in case. I'm gonna send a normal bad, um, for the entrance. I just like sending normal bads, I don't know why. And it looks like they're gonna start rushing us before we can start rushing them. So that's, uh, maybe good for them, Matt. Okay. Um, we're gonna sell this for the MAD here. Use this. We're gonna send them more. And I'm just gonna all out here, I guess. Boost. We're sending before them, so that's good. We still have one more boost left. I sell this for more. I'm just slowly selling off my fifth tiers here. And I should be able to clutch up the dub. They're not sending us any more, so... I just need to pop this layer down, and I'll be good. Unless I counter. I need money for countering, too. So, boost at them. Bloom boost. And, okay. We just need to pop this down. We're good. We're chilling. We're absolutely vibing. And I think they're gonna counter, right? They have to counter. They have to indeed counter that. Um, so this, balloon sabotage. Now we're just gonna defend with these things here. Um, I don't think I have to use any abilities. I'm just gonna get a ton of balloon sabotages here. Old meta, still meta here. Is it still meta? It looks like it's doing well. Yes. Boost, use the ability, use that. Use every single ability. Balloon boost on their side. And it looks like it's getting really far, so. Yeah, I think maybe we're gonna clutch up with the dub here, but the, at the same time, they have super storm, so they could indeed defend. They could defend here. Oh, they're defending. Oh my god. Wait, wait, are we both gonna defend? Oh no. Okay, this is actually really bad. They might defend this. They might, in fact, defend with those Avatar Wrath and the MAD. Okay, that, that, I don't know if that's pushing. I can't tell how much the gem BADs damage have on. Oh, are they going to pop that down? Please don't pop that down. They popped it down. Oh no, we're in some big trouble here. Um, oh my god. Okay, that, that actually worked. That was interesting. Their strat works. Oh my god. I should have maybe saved up more money for more rushes. For more MADs. For more BADs. But I don't know what I can do now. I think I just lost. I have no money. Um, I, I sold all my farms. I, I didn't think they would defend. That, like... I don't think they would defend that. That strategy, that's interesting there. We're gonna use this, we're gonna use MAD ability, and we have max open, that's interesting here. But, if I defend this, then we're just basically both gonna defend here. This is a really close match, but I think I'm gonna end up losing here. Since there's no way I can win. Um, unless it goes to round 40 and I somehow survive till then, because I have the life advantage, so... Yeah, I think we're going to end up going down here. Um, remember, remember to subscribe and like, but you can't say that now because I might actually defend this. Subscribe and like with your forehead, bro. Like, yeah, it's not even funny. Oh, we're just going to end up dying here. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Yeah, I think we're dead here. We're going to aim the MAD as best as we can. Oh, this is a really close match. GG's, Kane, GG's. I think you got me here. GG, just use all that. So, for, uh, that was too late. I hope you enjoyed the video, and peace.